you happy to have the jetty back open? Oh yes, sure. It's been a, it's been a while, hasn't it? It's been a while, but they've certainly done a good job. Yes, there we go. That's your salmon there. So that's an Australian salmon. Yeah. But uh, that would be a pretty good place to go swimming down there. Yeah, it certainly is now. Looks fantastic. Yeah. Well, great job. Thank you so much. Jetty's open. Jetty's open tweak. What do you reckon? Brand new. How long has it been Twig? Probably about a year and a half, maybe two years. Finally open again. Woohoo! They've done all the uh, brand new timbers. All chamfered off. This used to be old hole in the wall. Not hole in the wall, hole in the floor. But it's all properly done. Amazing. Oh, 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 oh. The dogs are liking the new jetty. Check this contraption out. With Jake in the back. Double trailer. See you later. Hey Pete, how it's good to have the new jetty open, isn't it? It's great. We've waited for it. We've waited a while, haven't waited we? Waited forever. Waited forever. Yeah, we'll Excellent. Have fishing, next time. fishing rod. I'm going to bring the fishing rod either, yeah. if not tonight, tomorrow. That's supposed to rain tomorrow, I think. This is the shelter, what I call the bus stop. And this is where you can go and fish undercover. And it's the largest structure now because the old bit that used to be right here the big jetty the big uh, ferry ferry structure the ferry on and off ramp has been taken away so now we just have uh, have the bus stop that I call it and also has railings all the way across now so it's a lot safer all right, now we're making it out towards the end. Hopefully it's not too windy for the sound. Pigeons are still here. And you can see uh, some of the older wood, newer wood here, been done. So it's all new, solid timber. And we're here at to talk to George, the fisherman at the very end. Let's go. All right, getting to the end. This bit's called the dolphin. Uh, I don't know the origins of that name, uh, it's a standard name. It's where the boats used to moor up to, the big big uh, ferries. So this is the dolphin and you can see it's been uh, the domain of the birds recently. All the white, you know what. So let's go out into the dolphin and talk to George. George Lonza the legend. George, how are you? Hello sir. I'm Stan from the Islander. All oh, right. How are you? Good. You happy to have the jetty back open? Oh yes, sure. It's been a, it's been a while, hasn't it? It's been a while, but they've certainly done a good job. Yeah, it looks great. I like how the the new wood all looks fantastic, and they've got um, all barriers around it and everything. Yeah, pretty safe. And um, it's a bit different because the uh, the old True Bridge ramp's gone, so there might be a bit of new new ground to fish on the other side there. Yes, well, that's a few more patches where we can fish without uh, you know, make it more comfortable. And how long have you fished on the jetty for, George? Oh, it must be uh, 40 years, 50 years. You were the original park ranger or park caretaker out at Flinders Chase? Oh, yes, yeah. So when, when what years were they roughly? Well, I, I went there in 1948. Right. And then uh, retired in 1983. So that was almost... Um, 33 years or something. Yeah, well, I think more than that. We'll work it out. I was and, the longest-serving ranger at the, on any one place at that time. Right. And um, have you caught any fish today? Yeah, a couple of salmon. Can, are they within reach? You can show me. 
Wait. Are they within reach, or you threw them back? Oh uh, no, they're in my bucket. Because we might get a photo for the paper. No. We'll let you get the salmon. All right, George. There we go. That's your salmon there. So that's an Australian salmon. Yeah. He's probably about I don't know 30 centimeters or so. I'd say. Yeah, probably. And you've bled him properly, so you can uh, you can have make fish cakes out of him, or even just the uh, fillets. Well, probably all the. I keep these and give them to a friend of mine. Who, oh, yep, there you go. Who got burnt in the fire. Oh, well, that's no He good. lost everything, but they do like their fish. They do like their fish. Oh, well, that's very generous of you, George. Very nice. And, and um, you catch whiting off here as well? And squid? Uh, well, like we usually do, but it, it seems to be that when all this work's been going on, it takes a while for the fish to get right. used to them because uh, this morning there were heaps of fish here right? and uh, they'd just nibble your cockle off but you couldn't hook them, you know, right. as if they were frightened or they something. Were, they were being temperamental. But they're a bit like that anyhow. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Here we go. You haven't got your drone today. No. <laughs>